A laser is pointed into a prism so that no light escapes from the front face. An invisible radiation continues on, however, and has recently been named evanescent waves. These waves can be made visible using a lens brought very close to the surface of the prism. The lens must be slightly curved, allowing it to be rocked back and forth. This motion creates a very thin air gap that is required for the evanescent waves to pass. Once the evanescent waves enter the curved lens, it converts back to visible light and can be observed as a red spot. If you look carefully near the center of the prism, you will see a moving black spot. This is the point of contact between the prism and the curved lens. A red halo surrounds the black spot when it is in the region of the evanescent waves. To the right edge of the lens, the secondary exit beam can be seen. A moving red spot is also visible, and this is the point of inward reflection of the secondary beam before it reaches the edge. This is a close-up of the point of contact showing the red halo of the evanescent waves. Compare this to Isaac Newton's observations that he published in his famous work Optics of the year 1718. The evanescent wave spot can be made visible by moving the end of the lens across the prism face. The spot is brighter towards the center and dimmer at the edges. To prove that no normal light is coming out of the prism face, a thin piece of paper is brought to the surface. No light can be seen. Finally, if we rock the lens horizontally, the reflection spot can be seen moving from left to right. Impossible properties of evanescent waves. Zero time crossing the gap via tunneling. Superluminal propagation of the center of mass of the pulse. Signal velocity faster than C. These conclusions taken by Nimitz et al. in 2003. Normal light has momentum and spin components that are in the direction of wave propagation. Surprisingly, the researchers found that evanescent waves carry momentum and spin components that are orthogonal to the direction of wave propagation. Nature Communications, 2014. Radio, microwaves, heat, light, and x-rays have all been shown to produce evanescent waves. Modern science denies that these waves carry energy, but Microsoft, MIT, and others are already developing wireless charging devices from this technology. Invisible radiation that carries energy and travels faster than light only fits with an ether model of space.